My people, only Ovife has received the bigger shock of his life. And anybody who said the person did not see this coming, the person is a joker. Yes, because we all vividly saw this coming. We saw it pointing directly to his direction. But everybody was beginning to have faith that no, 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 it will not happen. It will not be so. Every single thing will be different. It will come out. It will come out in a different state. And here we are today. <laughs> My people, oh, hey, wahala, no, they finish. Wahala, no, go finish. So now, according to what we heard, oh, allegedly, Olori Miriam, who is very good at sneaking in on people, she has sneaked in on Olori Naomi in Akure once again. And this time around, the only is not finding it funny because it came as, as a shock to him. Because what is Miriam doing in Akure? You know, they have asked this question a million times. The last time she went to Akure and, you know, Naomi even had to tell her to leave her apartment. Some people were asking that, what are you doing here? Yes, some people even had to ask that, what are you doing here? And, you know, it has actually become so, so unfortunate, very, very unfortunate that these women have developed this character of not, of, of, of not even sending whatsoever happens, of not feeling like ah, this thing we are doing might come with consequences or, or this thing we are doing is bad or, you know, that kind of feeling. The, they don't even care at this point. They are just saying that whatsoever happens, let it happen. Because as it is right now, only we now me raised an alarm that Miriam has invaded her house in Akure. And, you know, Oni was shocked. Yes, Oni was shocked to his bones that how come? Because over the time, we know that Miriam has had her way around every single thing. But in this case... How does she make it there? Because they have been keeping an eye on Miriam lately. Oh, yes. They have been keeping an eye on Miriam lately. Because Miriam have done a lot of things in recent times that does not speak good of a person. And for Olivi Naomi's sake, her protection, her growth, and her well-being, they only decided to keep a little eye on this woman because they are capable of anything. And now, my people, of all the times that Miriam would choose to invade Olori Naomi in Akure, it was in her church. And when the only heard this news, he was thrown off balance. That how does his wife think? How do they calculate? How do they do the things they do? Because at this point, he is at the verge of giving up on them. Seriously, he's at the verge of giving up. So, my people, this is the story. Olori Naomi was in church with uh, with her people Norma on a normal on a normal day they were having their their sermon and the next thing they said people invaded into the church apparently these are the people whom Miriam had come with yes the convoy drove in people came into the church standing with guns everywhere <sighs> What is happening? And the next day, Miriam walked into the church, told, told Naomi they need to talk. <laughs> My people, what exactly do they have to talk about? Because if you want to weigh the options right, these women have had more than a million opportunities to speak with Olu and Naomi. But the last time we checked, they threw it away themselves. They ruined it. Down to a point that Naomi even came into the palace. Yes, when Naomi came into the palace, it was entirely Naomi's decision on what happened. Yes, we know it was entirely her decision, but she did not stop anybody from communicating with her. That we know. So why didn't all of those communications go on? Why didn't these women have all of these communications with Olui Naomi as of when it was necessary? Not now that it's more like Naomi was held hostage in her church for a conversation. Because the way this scene is going right now, the owner is not finding it funny. He's looking at it more in a direction that Olui Naomi was held a hostage. And he, that was why when the news reached him, he was shocked. That, ah, why would Miriam hold um, his wife hostage right inside her church? Simply because what, she wants to have a conversation. So my, peop so my people, even to, 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 to look into this matter now, the only is being... It's been perplexed about the whole thing that, no, why would Naomi be, be held in her church at gunpoint that they want to have a discussion? Who does that? If you want to discuss with someone in such a way that the person will give you vital information or will give you an advice or will give you a response that matters, 
you don't you, you don't hold the person at gunpoint. No, you don't do that. What you do is you have a mutual conversation in a very right state if right uh, state of mind so that the person can be able to what, give you the output and feedback you need, not at gunpoint. That is what the owner is saying now. Well, this is it's not only the owner that is shocked. It is not in the only. Everybody is shocked at the sound of this news because these women keep on doing things day after day that does not speak of their personality. If you want to ask, oh, who held another person hostage? They will now tell you that ah, it is the only's wife, oh, and one of his wives held another of his wife hostage in church so that she wants to have because she wants to have a conversation. It does not really, really speak of who they are, and it does not make sense as it is supposed to be. But my people, right now. Now, these women keep feeling day after day that whatsoever it is they are doing is right. Whatsoever it is they are getting themselves involved in, it is only the right thing that is meant to be there. And right now, believe me or not, whatsoever happens, whatsoever happens, there are consequences attached to these things. And if these women categorically decide that, and this is who we are and this is what we are capable of, I guess the only is in one way or the other ready with them. Yes, I guess he is also ready with them because holding Naomi hostage in church because he wants to have a conversation simply because uh, the last time you were in her house, she had the youth throw you out. So you don't want to have a conversation in the house. You want your conversation in church and you want the conversation in such a way that she cannot call anybody to come and throw you out. Ah, ah. Now, so you don't be rich. Talk, my people, Lou. <laughs> These are the only wives, the women who are capable of any single thing. Just expect anything from them. Because over the years, only have really, really tried. If only if they say only has not tried, ah, oh, it's a joke. Only has really, really tried. And if you want to speak about the truth, only has endured a lot. And right now, if he decides to take an action about this, nobody will blame him. Nobody will blame him. 